What? What, what, what? What the hell is this? Harumph, 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 harumph. I didn't get a harumph out of that guy. Give the governor harumph. Harumph. You watch your ass. I see you shiver with anticipation. Let the show begin. Hey, hey, everybody, this is David Heretic coming at you with another edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. And tonight. Tonight! All right, we're going back to Sigabatsu. Yes, indeed. Sigabatsu fans, feeling you. Come on now. Here we go. Before we go any further, for those of you who are feeling inclined to doing all the clicks and the likes and the bibbity boobity bob, do me a favor before you do all that stuff. Please watch the whole video first, okay? Give me a chance to actually earn those clicks and likes. Now, after the video's done, if you still feel like doing all those clicks and likes, then by all means, feel free to click away. This comes as a request from Brett Parks, and this is actually one of Brett's three prioritized requests for the month of January for being a gold tier member on the Patreon page. So, here you go, Brett. Hope you enjoy the show, man. Uh, Brett wanted to see me react to this. It is Sigamatsu with a tune called Digitalian Rhapsody. Now, have I heard the song before? No, I have not. To the best of my knowledge, this does not resonate with me in any way, shape, or form. However, there's always a possibility I may have heard the song in passing and I just don't realize it. So as always, if I start listening to the song and I suddenly go, wait a minute, hang on, I recognize this song. I'll let you know. That's the truth. You know me, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This was posted by Far Heffrich, okay? And the video has 1,500 views. Eh, not gonna get you there. No, I'm sorry. No, look, I, I'm sure the song is fine. I'm sure the video is fine. I'm sure everything is fine. I'm just saying, 1,500 views, eh, it's not gonna get you there. Other than that, there's really nothing else left to say. Link to the original video will be down below in the video description for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. Let's get started. What do you say? Are you ready? Are you ready? Because here we go. All right, here we go. I believe that says Sigamatsu. I, I, I think I see those same three symbols like every time. So I'm almost positive that says Sigamatsu. Uh, we got it here. I have no idea. Probably it says Digitalian Rhapsody, but I don't know for sure. But we got there, so either way, we're covered. All right, let's do this. All right, boy, let's do this. Trying to think of how I'm gonna say this. <laughs> um Okay. 
I've heard some songs from Single Monster now that have been they're 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 still rockers without question, but they're they're definitely kind of growing a little more toward that that poppy realm, that that kind of, that like pop rock realm. And then I've heard other songs from Sigamatsu that has just been heavy and intense and thick and and uh, dirty, and it just sounds amazing, like on a hard rock uh, feel. This is somewhere in the middle. Uh, it, it has a, a couple of little poppy elements to it, but the the push and the drive are absolutely there in the hard rock style. So this is right about in the middle. Um, it's it, it's cool. I, I got no issue with it at all. Um, everything sounds good. Guitar sounds really good. Love those downstrokes on the picking. Um, the harmonies. I mean. Every time these guys do harmonies, I, I expect them now to be on point. And I'm, I'm glad to say I'm not disappointed. Uh, they're once again delivering on their harmonies without question. Uh, the drumming sounds really good. I like the approach in the beginning where he didn't even touch the snare. It was just kicking hi-hat. I like that. Keeping everything kind of sparse and keeping everybody guessing as to how is this going to go. Is this going to be a straight ahead feel? Is this going to have like a double time feel to it? We don't know. Not until he starts hitting that snare. And it kind of gives that feeling of anticipation. I, I like that. I definitely like that. Um, let's keep going. I have a feeling we got a guitar solo here. Let me back it up. I just, I, I'm getting that feeling. Um, yeah, I mean, it, I, I really don't have a whole lot more to say at the moment. If I'm being honest, I'm just, I'm, to be honest with you folks, I'm pausing for copyright. Um, still feels good. Still sounds good across the board. No complaints on any side of the spectrum here. It sounds really nice um yeah so i'm just ah good old copyright you know i just ah boy anyway um let's yeah, let's get to the guitar solo which i think we're having i don't even know if we're actually having one it sounds like we're having one and then uh, we'll finish this out and we'll get to the review Angel. Oh, 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 oh,
I like that. That was a great ending. Solid, strong ending. Um, not really a whole lot to talk about, if I'm being honest. This is this is pretty straight ahead, so uh, it shouldn't take me long to get my thoughts together. But uh, give me a minute just to be on the safe side. I'll see you in the review, and we'll talk about it. Well, there you go, folks. That was Sigamatsu with Digitalian Rhapsody. This was a request from Brett Parks. And this was actually one of Brett's three prioritized requests for the month of January for being a gold tier member on the Patreon page. So there you go, Brett. Hope you enjoyed the show, man. Um, okay, I got my rating. And uh, I'm just warning you right now, this is going to be a short review. So uh, don't get too comfortable. Out of a possible five stars, I am going to give that four stars. Yep, four to five stars. I feel good about that score. Let me tell you why. Why? I honestly have zero complaints about the song. Uh, none. It, it, it felt good. It sounded good all the way through. It had a really nice groove to it. Um... It just felt good all the way through from start to finish. There, there was nothing about the song I would I want to mess with. Uh, guitar sounded really nice as always. They sounded clean. They sounded crisp. Nice, good, chunky tone. Not overly thick. As a matter of fact, honestly, it, I think they could even get a little bit thicker. But for the time, I, this doesn't look like it's recent. So for the time, that's about as you know thick as you as most bands would get. So no problems there. I could actually hear the bass clear as day. That was nice to hear. Uh, bass player sounded good with everything he was doing. Drumming sounded really nice as well. I loved the beginning where he laid off the snare uh, for pretty much the entire first half of the first verse. And it was just hi-hat and kick. It, it gave it that sense of anticipation. You weren't sure. Are we gonna go with a straight time feel, a half time feel, a double time feel? We don't know because all we had were just straight eights on the hi-hat and the kick on the, on the on the downbeats. And I was like, well, this could go in any direction. This really could go anywhere. We could go straight time, we could go double time, we could go half time. I, I don't know. I guess we'll have to wait and see where the snare placement comes in a little bit later. And as we saw, it was a straight time rock and roll feel. No problem with that at all. Uh, the keyboard player, I don't feel like he gets enough credit. And I, I know he likes to kind of stay in the background and. He doesn't really like to be noticed, and he just he just wants to be there to be a part of the action, but not have the spotlight on him. But I gotta say, the the piano parts really added to this song. They really did. They definitely filled out the sound, but more importantly, they set up the song as a whole. I mean, right right at the very beginning, it, it was there. It was prominent. So I I dug it. I gotta give gotta give props to the keyboard player. I know he doesn't like the the attention, but you know, too bad. You know, listen, if you're going to be in a rock band, you got to accept the fact that you're going to get some attention whether you want it or not, you know? Uh, the lead vocalist, Demon, sounded great as always. Um, good good projection, good tone, uh, good pitch. Um, I love his stage presence. I, I love I love the stage presence from everybody in the band. I, that That's not a big surprise. So, uh, no, overall, I think they did a great job. I really do. I, I think they did a, a really nice job with the song. Like I said, the song for me was kind of middle of the road uh, between somewhere between the hard rock and the pop rock that I've heard from them, and they've done both. This is one. Of, this one's one of those songs that's kind of in the middle. Uh, I definitely see the attraction for it. I could see a song like this being a hit, um, you know, for them absolutely because I, I can see the appeal, especially thanks mostly thanks to those harmonies in the chorus. Uh, the chorus is the is the hook without question, and those harmonies are a big art of why that hookiness is happening within the chorus so no overall great job really enjoyed it four to five stars i feel good about that rating and that is where we're gonna stay so four to five stars final score i have spoken well that's gonna do it for this edition of reactions reviews and rants hope you all enjoyed the show hopefully i was able to entertain you 
If I was able to put a smile on your face and brighten your day, then I did my job, and I'm so glad I could do it. If you guys feel like joining the fan base, go ahead and click on that button down there. If you guys want to like the video, go ahead and like the video. If you guys want to ring the bell, go ahead and ring the bell. It honestly doesn't make any difference at all to me, but if you guys feel like doing these things, then by all means, feel free to do so. Well, that's going to do it for tonight, folks. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, this is David Heretic signing off, reminding you to stay fabulous and support each other. Later. Peace.